Hey guys, welcome to the video. We just went and dropped the dogs off at the dog groomer because they need haircuts and a bath, super duper bad. I have both boys with me and we're gonna go on a little mother Sunday date. <gasps> oh, oh. Uh... What do you rate it? 10. Me too. How about you? What do you rate it? 50. 50? Okay, we're all done with our little date. We went to a local bakery and it was so good, huh boys? We're not driving that street. We just came out of TJ Maxx and it's smelling pretty good now. Catch snowflakes. I can see some snow in your hair. <laughs> <laughs> kitchen. Keely and I are getting ready to make English pasties. This is a recipe that my grandfather used to make. So we're actually going to be making them in honor of him because today is the one year anniversary of his passing. If you don't know what a pasty is, it's a pastry that has steak and potatoes inside and it originates, I believe, in Cornwall, England. A lot of my grandfather's family came over from Cornwall and it's a, a food that miners used to take with them in their lunch pails to mine. Um, so we actually have my grandfather's recipe here and we're going to be working off of that. I've never made them. Keely's never made them. So we're going to see how it goes. We're going to be substituting some things to try and make them gluten and dairy free. So hopefully that pans out. My sister will be very interested to know if that works because she's also gluten and dairy free. Is, that, is this five? No. It's four. Yeah. Three. Sure? I'm Two. It's twelve. Okay. Four. You did, you did four. six. Okay. You did fourteen. You guys better not screw this up. You One thing I have help. noticed five. is uh, I'm definitely the clean cooker. I, I just clean the kitchen. Maybe compared to the kids. I just clean the tray. That's bad. It looks bad. Wasn't that bad. You know, Keely's the one who stirred the eggs on the stove. <gasps> I take it back. It's your fault. You better take it back. Because your chest is you can't share. <gasps> okay, so the recipe calls for shortening. I may have said that already, but I don't really want to use shortening because it's not very good for you. So we're going to try this coconut spread. I used it for biscuits before and it seemed like it did a really good job for that. Pie. Good. Okay, so it calls for one and a half cups. My understanding is that shortening is makes things thicker than a regular butter, so we're gonna maybe try one and a quarter cups and see how that works out for us.
Okay, our pasties are done. The dough is not browned, and I'm not sure if that has to do with the fact that we used a gluten-free flour or that we didn't do an egg wash, which it doesn't call for. But I'm excited to try them. Let me show you. They smell about right to me. They smell really good. They, they're bringing back all the memories to me. I only had these a couple times when my grandpa made them, but they smell familiar. What do you think? Mm. Oh, what did you think, Colin? Give it a thumbs up. You like it? Okay, we have made it to volleyball. We've actually been here for a little while. We picked up the dogs. I don't think we videoed picking up the dogs at all. I don't know. I was eating my... Like, like, pasty. Pasty. Pasty is something totally different. <laughs> no, we, we picked up the dogs, but they were ready right about the time, like just before volleyball. So we ran, picked them up, Kevin dropped Keely and I off at volleyball, and then ran the dogs home, and then came back here to finish up watching volleyball. So we're all just chilling. What do you think? You think this is a pretty sweet viewing situation compared to when she played for the middle school? Chairs are much more comfortable. There were no chairs at the middle school. We sat on the floor. It's pretty sweet. And I have my laptop here. I can get some work done. Kevin is totally watching a show on his phone. No, I'm not watching her play volleyball. But you can still see it. You can still see over and watch them play. It's cool. Did you do a panoramic view? Welcome to the show. You go for a run? Yeah. Okay. See ya. He is not wearing the appropriate footwear for running, but he really wants to, so I'm gonna let him do it. Hopefully he doesn't trip on his boot. One lap and you're all good to go? Yes. How's it big? It is big. Look at this, me and Keely have the whole place to ourselves, Keely. Look at this. I think that's because Keely's the most committed kid to helping put things away, and then she has to get her warm clothes back on. Look at those guys. I have a surprise for you guys. What is it? Yeah, we told that they didn't have enough restaurants, so that they better hurry up and get this one up here. So, coming up here on the right, you can see what's coming up. Clovers! Clovers! My camera did not focus on it at all, but we just got a Culver's. They just opened it, I think, was it today? I don't know. Guys, let me tell you something. They are get... packed. Yeah, they are. <laughs> They're yeah, super packed, ahead. especially considering that it's like 9.30 on a school night. For our little town, I saw a lot of activity for nine o'clock at night. Yeah, you're gonna run out of food. Probably. It's completely dead in Target. I'm pretty sure it's because everyone's at Culver's. <laughs> it's literally like abandoned in here and our Target's never like that. It's like abandoned. I think you can hear a cricket. We're home. Hello, on the rain. Where's Kitty? Where oh, she's here? in. When I got these new pillows for the couch, I made a rule that the dogs weren't allowed on them at all because these two dogs are notorious for laying on the pillows. Like, it doesn't matter if they have a bed, they want to just lay on the pillows. But look at Maggie. You see that? That's all three couch pillows. Don't they look so good with their fresh haircut, though? I'm letting her get away with laying on the pillows because she's fresh and clean. That's, that's at least what I'm telling myself. Max was over on the dog bed and then he heard me talking to the camera and decided he should be involved. Also, he wants to smell my breath. Does it smell like pasties? Okay guys, with that I'm going to go ahead and end this video. The kids are off to bed. Kevin is just relaxing, playing some video games. Obviously the dogs are lounging around. Anyway, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe if you like our videos, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!